Okay, so the Texas A&M Corpus Christi men's basketball team is back in the big dance as they made the NCAA tournament for the second year in a row. Yeah, and for the first time in program history, they have made it in back to back seasons. Our very own Chris Thomason traveled with the team to Dayton as they prepare for the first four. He joins us now live. So how's it going up there, Chris? Hey there, Leslie and Rudy. Well, here inside the University of Dayton Arena, it feels great. It's pretty cold outside. More on that in a second. Now, you mentioned back-to-back -back seasons. Well, last year was kind of a travel disaster for the Islanders. They were about three hours late getting here. They missed the press conference. They were late on the shoot-around. Well, this time was pretty smooth sailing. Now, the Islanders also are going to be on six days rest by the time they hit the court tomorrow against Southeast Missouri State. Last year, they were going on just a couple days rest. Well, I talked with Coach Lutz about that, but also wanting a better trip this year. And, you know, the travel this year seems to be going so far uh, better, right? Hey, knock on wood, right? I mean, uh, we've gotten through security fairly quickly thus far. Um, you know, everyone seems more prepared. The plane's here on time, so now we just got to get on it and then go do our part and win a basketball game. The only ones who weren't prepared, the dance team, because it was cold. It was snowing when we got off the plane here in Ohio, and you could tell they were feeling it. Now, tonight at 10, you'll hear from the guys on being back here in Dayton and the support they're getting from star point guard Terion Murdix, who injured his knee in the Southland tournament. He is done for the season, but he is here to root on his guys. Again, the Islanders will take on Southeast Missouri State out of the Ohio Valley Conference. That game will be tomorrow, 540 Corpus time. 640 here, but 540 Corpus time and can be seen on True TV. Reporting live from the University of Dayton Arena and the first four, Chris Thomason, 3 News. Back over to you. So exciting we, for Chris and everybody here in South Texas watching the Islanders. I know. All eyes on them. We are so pumped for them. And of course, for Chris, what an awesome experience. Absolutely.